My name is uh, Ernest Edmonds. I'm an artist who's worked with computers since the 1960s, and I've also spent a lot of my life conducting research about creativity and computers. I'm talking today about AI in art, back from the origins of that subject. Uh, people like Harold Cohen and Edward Vinatovich and what they did. And I'm reviewing the progress of my work, but in particular I'm asking some questions about AI and art. Can AI make art? Can AI be the artist? Or can AI be helpful to the artist? I come down on the last as the one that I agree with. I try to distinguish very carefully between different kinds of AI. And this is really important because in the popular mind today, AI is only one aspect of it. So the phrase AI means what is technically connectionist or neural network AI, pattern recognition, which has lots of problems associated with it, especially ethical ones. For example, last week uh, in San Francisco, face recognition systems using that kind of AI have been banned from use by police and associated uh, bodies. Whereas symbolic AI, where the AI descriptions are explicit, miss out on having this difficulty and are much more interesting for the artist because you can interrogate and think about what the art is doing, why it is doing it, and what one's goals are as a creative person. For me, uh, creative AI is adding to the possibilities of what can be done. It's enabling art to be more interactive and engaged with the audience. And it enables the artist to build interactive art in a much more responsive and exciting way. So I'm about to chair the panel discussion this afternoon, and although the uh, panel members don't know it yet, what I'm going to do is start by asking them each to say what have they learned today or what new question has arisen in their minds today. And then I will use that as the basis of having a discussion, hopefully, with the audience about the issues so that we're not just spending the day presenting, hey, there's all this great stuff, but that we actually spend the day debating issues and questions that are important for us all to understand about creativity, art, and AI. So for me personally, I found AI has stimulated a massive amount of work that I have found very positive in my art. Most importantly, the kind of work that I've been doing in the last 10, 20 years, where the artwork learns from the audience and evolves and develops in itself over time, which kind of matches how we evolve ourselves and develop our understanding of artworks as we look at them over time. 